My first camera was a life-changing experience. I had a still camera when I was 12 and a video camera when I was 14. And that's back when cameras were pretty expensive. Well, I spent hours and hours just experimenting and writing, shooting, directing, and editing short films. Ultimately went to grad school for film. It was um, so helpful to have those early visual experiences and start to begin to understand the language of cinema. A lot of times you picture your career uh, developing in a certain way. It's sort of like a house, and you think, well, I'm just gonna go in the front door, and a lot of times the front door is locked, and so you might have to go around to the side door, or a back window, or something. A great thing happens along the way. It builds character, it gives you something to say, and we're often defined by our struggles. So many of the great films, American films from the 70s, and foreign films from the 50s and 60s, and they all had something to say, and they had a, a soulfulness about them. And, daring spirit. Always keep my eyes open for the next wave and uh, a lot of the kids here at SCAD will be a part of that wave or create a new one. <laughs>